Welcome back. Okay. Okay, thanks to Elliot in the previous part, we saved a horse. It's a good job we had him there, but we need to head to the temporary guild branch. See about how we're going to infiltrate the mansion. You had some idea of how to get into the mansion, uh, didn't you, Elliot? Elliot's just full of surprises at the moment, so I wouldn't be surprised if he has something up his sleeve. Yeah, that's right. You ready for me to get into the details? Certainly. Once you enter the Guild Branch office, the main story will progress and your investigation of the town will conclude. Please note that all quests and sub-events you have yet to complete will disappear. Battles ahead may be difficult. It is recommended that you be fully prepared before proceeding. Take... Take in the Guild Branch office? Yeah, we'll take it in. We'll take it in. Just really go in there and take in the atmosphere. We'll talk in there as well at the same time. No, do both. Two birds, one stone. With that, Rin and the others entered the temporary Guild Branch office. They then settled in and listened to Elliot's idea. A performance? Dun, dun. Yep, that's what I came up with. Sneaking into the mansion would be no easy feat. So, what if we got Marquis Ballard himself to let us in? Think we could pull that off? Hmm. They do summon dancers and other performers to the mansion. And the interim supervisor has apparently been rather stressed as of late. So it's a way to let him blow off some steam that the Imperial Defense Force turn a blind eye to. The power of music just might come through for us after all. Again? Alright. Well, our best shot on that is with you, Elliot. You're kind of famous at this point, though. Isn't it risky to put yourself out there? It is. I might stick out like a sore thumb and get apprehended by the Imperial Defense Force if things go south. But... I want to have some faith. Faith of the heart. The Empire is being dragged by the forces of conflict and the curse, and it's stagnating as a result. But music can't be bound by anything. In fact, it should breathe fresh life back into all those who listen. Oh. Elliot. So, I more than accept the chance to perform. None of you have to take this risk. If it goes well, that's just perfect. But even if the plan fails... Let me stop you right there! You violated the law! You pay the court fine or serve your sentence. Let your sir, you're starting to sound like Instructor Reen. I'm going to help you out no matter what. Only now do I understand the beauty of the performance I attended. Enough has been gambled. What matters now is how much of a success this turns out to be. You can't think that we'd let you go it alone. That's right. I'll pitch him what little I can to this performance too. So let's do this, Elliot. Guys, thank you. <laughs> I guess it was kind of rude of me to just skip over you guys like that. All right then. Reen, you've been playing the loot recently, right? Yeah. I mean, at least when I've had a chance since the Civil War. Well, with all we've got on the line, failure's not an option here. So step one, we find instruments for everyone. Yeah, I wonder where we could do that. Step two, we hold a huge, rigorous cram session to get you all on the same level, and then... So it's Persona 4? Wait a minute. It's not going to be possible in such a short time frame. Well, slow your roll, music boy. You weren't, uh, I'm gonna set him right when you've got that maniac grin on your face. Sheesh, this is stirring up flashbacks, all right. Could practically see that Academy Festival stage clear as day. But as much of a sweetheart as he is, he snapped into high-strung band leader mode pretty quick. Uh, we're not going to get anywhere without some level of skill. A less than stellar concert probably won't even be a blip on Ballad's radar. Why don't I lend you a hand? Indeed, Fiona. Fiona? Sorry, I didn't mean to eavesdrop. I know it's been a while, but I think we could still harmonize well together. After all, I did accompany you on your last record. In that case... Thanks. Now I'm feeling confident this performance will go off without a hitch. But if you really want to make sure...
hey, Altina, a little birdie told me something about a certain rabbit with the voice of an angel. Huh? Who could that be? Everyone then headed to the Cathedral Square. They received permission from the Archbishop and got to work on their plan. My desire to shop has just dried up lately. Can't get my mind off what's to become of our future. Would've been nice to hear some vocals. There we go. Oh! How beautiful. What a tranquil melody. She has such a wonderful voice. Hey, 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 hey. Oh my luck, Rico is laughing. What a miracle. Well, he's done late days cry. I could swear I've heard this music before. Nah, it's just your imagination. Thank you for listening. We're the Black Rabbit and the Red Haired Hares. Oh, dear. And we hope you enjoyed our show. The name needs some work. <laughs> Bravo! That was just splendid. What a pleasure. Such marvellous music goes straight to the heart in unsettled times as these. Indeed, it's like it's chased away all of my unease. Excellent job. Thank you. That was amazing. It's just a nod. Yes. Somehow... We made it through without issue. I had no idea what to expect of the end result when I was instructed to sing without any prior warning. <laughs> Sorry to put you on the spot. I just had faith you could run with it. Yeah, you were amazing, Ali. You held your own rather well for having two professionals beside you. That's right. Great work, Altina. You really made the most of the principal's lessons. Thank you. Though I think I owe it to more than just her. You've grown so much too, Elliot. I knew pursuing the path of music would be the perfect choice for you. Oh well, thanks. But I've still got a lot to learn. Pardon the interruption. I don't know, I will not pardon it. Ah. That was quicker than I expected. We come bearing a message from our lord. That performance you gave was most impressive. There is something we would like to request of you. Reen and the group were led away by Marquis Ballard's troops. They were hustled into the Marquis' mansion through a back door without the IDF noticing. So why did everyone get to go? That's what I find strange. They saw the performance, so it's like... Why did the entire group get invited? Pardon the intrusion, my lord. We brought the guest you requested. Ah, oh, at long last. So you're those musicians everyone's been talking about? And friends. We take our leave now, my lord. We are at your call, should you require anything further. Now wait just a minute! Clown Solaeus! <laughs> Audio insulation field activated. Though our mission plan was impromptu, it appears to have succeeded nonetheless. <laughs> Great! And now that we've made sure no one can hear you... We're just going to have ourselves a nice long chat, shall we? We shall. Whoa! Hey! You're making us sound like the bad guys here. He shot the Emperor. Uh, now, now, Elliot. Tone it down a bit. And... And... So, so someone here shot the Chancellor. It's like, you, 
you know, um, kind of do look like the bad guys. In a moment, your hair is different, but there's no doubt you're the Ashen Chevalier. Nice to see you again, Marquis Ballard. Hmm. I've fallen completely into your trap. I'm losing my touch. Since the downfall of the Imperial Provincial Council, it's been a downhill slope. Damn it all. So what do you want? I was destined for great things, but now I'm nothing more than a mere puppet of the government. Wow, what's with the attitude? It's not getting you anywhere, that's for sure. He's released the imprisoned members of Thor's and the Imperial Family at once. Thor's and the Imperial Family? <laughs> You're a fool! They're at Dracnor, aren't they? What? What do you mean? What I mean is, they're not here. Although it would have been splendid if we could have at least greeted the princess when she arrived. I see. So the member of the Imperial family that's here must be Princess Alvin. Well, duh. But she isn't here. Although, according to our intelligence, she should have been. Indeed, we also expected her to be held in custody here. But on her journey via train from the capital, she made a stopover at a certain location. She was with an exchange student from the Burl. Dita! An exchange student from the Burl. That must be. And she travelled by train. That means she must be at... Drechnor Fortress. That's where Dad and the 4th Armor Division are garrisoned. The group then retreated from the mansion, with Ballard promising not to stir up trouble on the way out the door. They returned to the Temperigo branch, and after checking in with the Macabre, started discussing their next move. So, we're going for Dregnor Fortress, huh? Man, that was a big headache. Yeah, but... It was still weird how willing he was to spill the beans to us, don't you think? Must be the curse. I didn't get the feeling he was lying. It may just have been his way of getting revenge. The crux of the matter is they're holding Princess Elfin hostage. Not to mention Tita. God, I can hear Al help echo in my head without even saying it. We have to assume that she'll be deported. I imagine it has some sort of connection to Estelle Bright's entering the Empire. Is it a diversion? Now it makes sense why we couldn't get in contact with Father or Nightheart. Yeah, but I'm having a hard time understanding why they're keeping Her Highness and Teeter at the fortress in the first place. Maybe they're anticipating our arrival. Yep, no doubt about it. Oh, it's you! Who's that? Oh, it's Randy. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Eckert, you came. Sarah got in contact with me. I'd been looking for Tita from here to Heimdall. Never thought I'd end up at some huge fortress like this. You collected information from the RMP, then? Yep. Turns out the 4th Armored Division's got Tita and the Princess. But I'm willing to bet there's a good reason they didn't mind letting Ballad and the RMP spill the beans. You don't think... Are they testing us? Probably. I want to see what move Class 7 will take now. That definitely sounds like Dad. And Nighthawk, too. Dracnor Fortress is the strongest base of the Imperial Army, and located in the southern reaches of Erebonia. Infiltration and hostage retrieval will prove extremely difficult. Yeah, this definitely outranked sneaking into some old mansion. Can't back down from this now. They're holding Her Highness and Tita hostage as we speak. We have to do whatever it takes to see them to safety. We counted our successes so far, both here and in Ordis, the uh, port city. So what could go wrong this time? A lot of things. Well, I'll plan on tagging along with you guys. I've got a duty as Tita's guardian, after all. Plus, this ain't my first time breaking into a military fort. What's that device you got there? I assume you have an idea of how to use it? Yeah, but it's got multiple steps. Just hang tight. 
I've got you all covered. Mm. Name of the game, everyone. Moments later. Dracnor Fortress. Can't see the plates. They're so tiny. You must be the delivery people. It's an Ark Express at your service. We brought you something from the department store. Must be something from Count Altheim. Here, let me have a look. Nothing out of the ordinary. By the way, have either of you received your draft cards? Nope, we're still in the clear. We really looked out. You lucked out. Is it not the duty of all young Imperial men to protect their country in times of crisis? How dare you make a mockery of your countrymen who have already been called to the front by calling yourself Lucky not to join them. But I'm sorry. I, I really didn't mean it like that. Hmm, if you say so. So, a biosensor is picking something up. What? What is the meaning of this? Huh? That doesn't make any sense. There, there, there's no way. There must be some mistake. That's enough out of the both of you. Just open the damn thing. Right away. It's a lean. Meow. Meow. Indeed. A cat? This feels like it's happened before. What's that doing in there? Sorry, it must have gotten mixed in with our shipment somehow. How can you mix in a cat? Well, whatever. Take the rest of the containers. Yes, sir. Cat aside, everything appears to be in order. I'll take it from here. You can take the cat with you. Thank you. Come on then, little cat. One. Can't say I love being called in to play decoy, but good luck in there, everyone. Just that little smirk on my face of like, this is so familiar, especially with Akit around. We're in. I'm out of breath. This isn't how I imagined it would be. Take it the device you used to block the biosensors from detecting us? You got it in one. The sensor blocker is a miniaturized version of an invention Tita's grandfather put together. You know, we did something similar a while back in the burl, but that black cat's little distraction came in handy too. A moment there, I thought we had been spotted. Yes, we owe Celine. Still hung up on something with Alan back there. He should be familiar with Celine, but he didn't even seem to recognize her. I was wondering that, and I was like, maybe it's because of the bow and the collar being taken off. He acted all creepy when we saw him in Crossbell, too. Something's got to be affecting his mind, like with those soldiers. Don't start again. The curse, no doubt. For now, we've got other things to worry about, though. And you stop bringing it up at every moment. We know. I mean, I'm sure we've mentioned it with Alan before as well, as part of the story. It's strangely empty here, don't you think? Yeah, even if it's the tradesman's entrance, you'd still expect some security around. Got a bad feeling about this. Well, we might as well keep going, right? 
We should be able to make our way up through here. Or there. It is like, it just... Ugh. Just that sort of thing, like... I, you don't need to be this sort of in explaining every single time that's the curse. We know. We know, but I'll shut up about it now, because it's like, you get the idea. Every time it's brought up, now I'm going to be like, ugh, in my head. But just let you know, I'll be ugh, in my head. Simple as that. I still did like what they did with Kaiser Dice, though. That was a good way of doing it. Greetings to you, Class 7, and to you as well, Heavy Blade. I had a feeling you'd come, Elliot. Oh, Dad! And Lieutenant Colonel Nightheart. Green! Agate! That voice! Is that you, Princess Elfin? Tina! You there too? Reen! Everyone! Thank the goddess you're all okay! Your Highness, we've been worried sick about you. Agate! <laughs> you really did come for me! <laughs> of course I did! I said I'd look after you, didn't I? I mean, I only got you captured and stuff. It's not that big of a deal. You have no cause for worry. Her Highness and Miss Russell are being treated with the utmost care. Correct. They are under our protection, after all. Not as prisoners, but as guests. Oh, so if they want to leave, they can. We'll be waiting for you in the control room on the top floor. Should you wish for their freedom? You will have to come here and earn it. However, you enter the headquarters of the 4th Armored Division. Loath as we are to use them, we do have Archaisms patrolling the premises. If you expect to make it past them, you'll need to give it your all. It's definitely a test. You can you can hear it in their voice, like, like as we suspected. It's like they are testing us, making sure we got the resolve to proceed onwards. Which is fine, we'll do it. think that's gonna stop us you got another thing coming you'd better believe we'll give it our all just you wait dad you too lieutenant colonel we will accomplish our mission damn right we will <sighs> i eagerly await your arrival my son and the rest of class seven as well my guess please be careful everyone may the goddess protect you it's good to know they're all right but man we suck at being stealthy. I thought we were staying pretty covert. It's almost like they knew we'd be coming somehow. Anyone who knows as well enough could easily predict we'd try to rescue the two of them. It's bad enough that we're dealing with arguably the strongest armor division there is, but we've also got to face our chasms on top of that. No need to take them all on at once, though. It can create a distraction to keep some enemies off you. Fee, that's... You gotta trust me a little, okay? I won't try anything too risky. I get you make sure Reen doesn't get into trouble while I'm gone. <laughs> sure. Have fun playing the decoy. Alright. Catch you later. Don't worry so much, Reen. She can manage on her own. Yeah, an ex Jaeger and Bracer like her won't go down easily. Let's go to that command room while she's keeping our hosts occupied. Got it. Good to have you with us, Agate. Alright, guys. Time to move out. The General's gonna get his ass handed to him. Alright, team. Commence assault on Drek'nor Fortress. Move out! Alright, music. Let's do this, guys! Right! Alright, so obviously... Um... Gotta do that, haven't we? Let's see. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. 
question is which way do we go? The shutters won't budge. I could try to break through with Clown Soleus, but I suspect it would be ineffective. Well, the army's technology is cutting edge. Let's just find the terminal to unlock them. Say that way. You stood there, mate. Like, what, are you, what are you doing? There! Now's our chance! And let's go hit you. There! They're mine! Alright! Uh, let's get him! Let's go, Ellie! Leave it to me! My turn! Okay, let's be down. Understood. Understood. It's my turn. Second, Second form. form Damn. It's down. There. This is the end. My turn. Let's just go hit it. There. Hostile suppressed. Continue mission. Some level up those. I must train even more. Ooh. That's how it's done. Bloom. Now, why would you have that up again? It's a test, but still, why would you have the controls on this side? I don't know. That like little mini cough then. Almost over my cold, by the way. Almost. Oh, hello. And there you are, Class 7. It's been a while, young Master Elliot. It's the 4th Armored Division. They're supposedly the strongest division in all of Edibonia, right? <laughs> I'd probably not call me young master anymore, okay? It's getting embarrassing. You won't let us through if I ask you nicely, will you? I'm afraid not. The General specifically asked us to give you a hard time. Well, we're not going to turn back. One way or another, we'll have to get past you and prove our resolve to my father. So I'm sorry, but we're not going to let you stand in our way. You've grown to be a fine, confident man. We'll be putting you to the test, though, to see just what you're made of. As we face war with Calvald, kind of poison the mind has spread among the troops. Strange weapons have been doled out. We soldiers of the 4th Armor Division proudly carry on. If you think we're in the wrong, prove it to us in battle. All right, and... Since you're asking for it... Yeah, we'll set you straight. Enough talk. Let's settle this. Engaging. Enemy found. Begin suppression. Um, right. Should I do that? I don't know. You can't escape. Fire! Now. Now. Again, let's go on you, actually. Yeah. Frozen. Not on my watch. My turn. Right now, we'll go up in the shade. Stealth mode. Activate. I'm up. Uh, yeah! It's my turn. Hmm. Get back! Now! There! My turn! Let's give you all a beat down.
petrified as well. I'm liking this debuffs we've got going. My turn. Petrified didn't last long, apparently. Uh, Brain X probably better. I mean, you're frozen, so that's fine. We I'm getting break on knees and not you. Let's go. No, petrified's there, isn't he? So I was wondering. I thought it was this one who was petrified, but no, it's just this guy's. He's fine. Take this, Inferno Gale! <laughs> huh? Now! There! I failed. Here I go. There you go. Hmm. Just get you dead. We should be right. There. You little. I shall go. Yeah. I failed. Hostile suppressed. Continue mission. Lovely. Doesn't really matter for us. I mean, it helps with Aga, but you know. Yeah, I did it! <laughs> nice. Your reputation is well deserved. Huh. Might just stand a chance against the general. Let me ask you something. You mentioned a poison of the mind. As far as you can tell, is Alan being affected by it? I'd like to know that too. Sounds like he's up and turned into a completely different person. I'd assume so. It's been happening all over. Something about this war makes soldiers abruptly change their behavior. Ulop might just be able to. They're all unconscious. What's happening with the army? Whatever it is, it only spells trouble. Let's keep going. Remain vigilant. Lloyd that. Okay. Huh. I see why they call these soldiers the strongest in Erebonia. Huh. We'd Ready. be in serious trouble if it was one-on-one. -on -one. Huh. Can I speak to him yet? <laughs> Unconscious. Uh, I'm sleeping. Unconscious. Dead. No. Oh, sorry about that. Did, didn't mean to uh, kill you. Sorry. No. Oh. I honestly expected that to be a trial. Chest. Look at the guys in the... It, the amount of ones coming up. Hey, oh. It's just archaisms. This bet can't be scared then. I'll take you weaklings on. Alright, well I'd like an order in it to be break and then actually try and get there. stuff going, there. but they're mine! Trying to hold off. Light up nicely for Return. us. Okay, now sledgehammer. Sledgehammer. My turn. There. Now, everyone. Okay. Leave it to me. Yeah. It's just that one guy. But of course, it's that one Let's guy. Go. Demon on change. I want to try and get, if I can, that one that's just coming up before everyone else. Get back. It's my turn. Okay, so let's just let's change it for that. Raging fire formation. It's my turn. You can't escape. Fire! Wide open. Alice. <laughs> My turn. I love the amount of deep buff she gets going out. Get up! And open. My turn. There. Now. There, Yuna. I got it. 
you little. I'm up. I failed. This is the blade of the eight leaves. Is that what it's called? All right. Skilled. All right. Got stats updated. <laughs> Yay! I, I must train Yay. even. <laughs> nice. That's how it's done. I'm assuming that's just unconscious. Or dead. One of the two. One of the two. Ugh, more shutters? There's a hole, isn't there? There's gotta be a terminal somewhere. Keep your eyes peeled. Understood! Someone mention it, someone do it. You always do. No? <laughs> Does it just me, me, me? Just still waiting for it now, so I feel like it's coming. Nothing about vents? Nothing? I feel betrayed. That one looks like trouble. Well, I'm sure we'll face one of them against other people as well, so... I wouldn't normally do one of every enemy, but... Again, I feel like we're going to be facing it regardless, so... 